We, too, had known the golden hours, when body and soul were in tune, had danced with our true loves by the light of the full moon, and sat with the wise and good, as tongues grew witty and gay over some noble dish out of a scoffier, had felt the intrusive glory which tears reserve apart, and would in the old grand manner have sung from a resonant heart, but pawed at and gossiped over by the promiscuous crowd, concocted by editors into spells to befuddle the crowd, all words like peace and love, all sane affirmative speech, had been soiled, profaned, debased, to a horrid mechanical screech. No civil style survived that pandemonium, but the wry sotto voco, ironic, and monochrome. And where should we find shelter for joy or mere content when little was left standing but the suburb of dissent? <laughs>